What's up guys, welcome to this new video. Today I'm bringing you another Snapchat video, but this time we are on an Android phone, as you can see. Um, and I'm gonna show you how to upload um, photos and videos from your camera roll into Snapchat and send them to people as actual snaps, as if they were real snaps, although they're fake and they're from your camera roll, obviously. Um, so I have this video for iPhone, you can check it up, up here already. Um, there's a new updated way to do it on iPhone, so. This is the way for Android how to do it. Let me just, let's get straight into it. So you're gonna need um, two apps. You can, have, you can just use one, but I recommend you download both and just use the one that um, you prefer and then use the other one for backup. Go into the Play Store. The first one is called DabSnap. This one right here, as you can see, I have it installed already. Um, if you have an install button right here, just, so just go ahead and install that. And the second one is actually the same app we have for iPhone, which is, sorry, OVF. OVF editor. So this one right here. Um, you also want to go ahead and install this. So now once you have this, um, I have these two apps right here. Um, so once you open the app, the menu here is really simple. There's a photo or video or sure Snapchat button. As you can see, I'll just click photo for now. Um, I'll just pick a screenshot. It doesn't even matter. Um, obviously you'll pick a picture on your camera roll. Um, but anyway, if this is the picture. I'll just click on share on Snapchat now. It'll load it here. Okay, so now what you want to do is drag this onto the trash icon right here. As you can see, there's a little trash icon, so just drag it here. Um, to remove the attachment and then click here on this icon, on the paper clip icon. And down here, you'll see a um, remove attachment. So also click that. Um, so there's no proof that it's from an outside app, but it looks as if um, it was a real app. Obviously, I'm using a screenshot, but it doesn't matter. Um, it's just to show you how it works. So then just go ahead and send it, I'll send it to myself. And now just to prove it to you guys, I'll send the natural snaps using the Snapchat camera. Um, and I'll just send it to myself. So you'll see that like the resolution is the same. There's no black bars and no anything. So let's go ahead and open it now. As you can see here, this is the first snap. Um, there is no black bars, no nothing. This is the actual resolution. It looks like this on the top because obviously it was a screenshot. And then if you open it here again, it's the exact same resolution. Um, so there's no really differences, nobody can notice, um, and it works perfectly. Okay, so now let's jump into the second method, open OVF editor, and it's the same exact interface as for iPhone. Um, if you haven't watched the video on how to do it for iPhone, I recommend you watch it. Um, it's in the link into the description. Anyway, you're gonna wanna click photo video here. Um, there's an ad on this one, so I, I would honestly use the other app, um, but a trick just to, Avoid the ad is actually open the app while you're offline and the ad will just not load and it will get you straight into the um, uploading the picture. So just click the X here, um, select the image. Um, once again, I'll just click this. It doesn't even matter just for the sake. You can even modify it here. There's a filter um, icon here, but if for the purpose we're using it for, you don't really need it. And we just click the take up here. Um, and now just click on share. It'll bring it to your Snapchat and same exact procedure. But now you don't even have to drag the thing in the trash and remove the attachment. It'll work just straight up like this. You just go ahead and send it. Send it to myself again. Once again, um, just as before, I'll send the Snapchat and Echo Snap to myself. So you can see there's no difference. Go ahead and open the first one. As you can see, no black bars, um, no weird um, resolution. Quality is good. And once again, this is the actual snap, same exact resolution. No black bars, no weird stuff. So yeah, guys, both these methods work. They also work with videos. I showed you for, for pictures, but um, they work with videos as well. Um, so you can just upload a video and it'll work the same way. So yeah, guys, thank you for watching. Um, this was how to upload snaps, um, fake snaps on Android. Uh, once again, the video for Apple is in the description. Um, I recommend you go watch it too. And yeah, guys, I'll see you soon. Peace.